Actually, you know what? I'm gonna leave all of these here. And then let's have the Odin. Let's see if the Odin can take all of this uh, on by its own. It's just an immediate wave of bullets. Next one, it's gonna take a little while. Oh, it's a beautiful game. I love it. You have been resupplied, so now let's take on Dagger Guild. I just have the one thing, I think. I'm just gonna immediately surrender. Yes. Still almost destroyed that thing. Now, actually, let me see. Diplomacy. Make peace. But I'm going to receive submission. I gain three reputations. So if I make peace with all of them and then demand to be crowned emperor, I hope that works. I can also demand tribute. Why not? Okay. So now we are truth with all those, and now I can also make peace with you. And uh, receive submission and also demand tribute. Okay, sweet. Now I just have to wait it out a little bit longer. Are there actually any buildings that uh, would grant me reputation? I don't think so. But I can take out the mad scientists over here. That would uh, certainly grant me a little bit of reputation. So let's have the Odin uh, take on scientists. And let's see how it goes. All the way in the back. Let's go. The problem is that these things are very fast. Oh, but the Vulcan is doing a lot of work. Ooh. Um. Okay, it's not looking good, if I'm being honest. Yep, I'm gonna flee. I think I'm gonna need my whole fleet to assemble here. Uh, double fleet supply element, yes. That sounds good. I'm going to merge my fleet over here. In the meantime, can I send another delegation? I cannot. What do we have here? Lava plumes. I'm going to send them over here in the center for now. And I also have some over here, which I'm going to send back to my capital. Just extender? Yes, I do want that. Mad scientist fleet? Yeah, I don't really care about that right now. Do I care? I think I do care. Ah, just a little bit of income that I lose, so... Which I don't really need that badly. I can try. I can try. I do have my... 
and lava plumes. Are they on standard fire? Yes. Bring it. Actually, I do want them to be on aimed fire. Make every shot count. Come on, don't be shy. Yep, just ram yourselves. Yep, here they come. They do take a lot of damage though. I'm not even a scratch on that thing. Well, let me just move up just a little bit. Oh, here we go. Now just pound them. Nice. Nice. Sweet. Raid repelled. Not peace. Yes. Does that mean I can send some more delegations? Uh, they have grievances towards us. Much weaker. They are cooperative. Also alliance, paranoid, and cooperative. So how about we make an alliance? No. They would not like that. Okay, just one more and then I can uh, tr attempt to become em emperor. Which is fun. Now... Where did my Odin go to? There it is. I'm going to merge this fleet here and then take out the mad scientists. There's also another group of mad scientists over here. Uh, no. How about uh, a research treaty and I receive submission. I guess torpedoes. Oh, here we go, here we go. Can I now uh, attempt to become emperor? Need to control seven cities. Hmm. So cities are the big things, I think, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. I would need one more. I, I, I guess Walton? We're allies. Hmm. So how about diplomacy? I make an offer. I demand... Oh, 2,000! Ugh. Ah. Uh, what's a small nation? Scarol only has that one thing left. And we are at peace. Hmm. Ugh. Um. Difficult. I don't really need trade trees right now. Alliance. Can I? Demand. That's yeah, not gonna work. Uh, what about you? Hmm. Hold on, no, we would only be at war with these guys. So I think that would work. I hope. What do we have here? 
Uh, over here in Crack Marina, I'm going to build another land ship. I think I want some more lava plumes. Two more. And once there, then I'm going to uh, declare war here. I think that should work. I think. I hope. Well, that fleet should have been merged. Yes, so now let's clap those scientists once and for all. Cancel tribute? Absolutely not. Nice. Some more delegations. Love it. Yes, like so. And you're immediately going to ram into this thing. Yeah, let's focus the squids. That thing is going to grind into there. Nice. Love it. All of you can now move up. You can also move up. Oh, that's it. Okay. Perfect. Reputation and also mechanical sky squid. Yo, okay. And now defeat those other scientists. scientists. And in the meantime, I think. Yes. I can build mechanical sky squids. Robotic flying squid equipped with multiple tentacles. Yes, please. Give me that. And you got two robots and uh, also that thing. Okay. Just ram forward. Let's grind these things. <laughs> oh. Oh, look. I've been impaled. You move, don't move up. Oh, that's it. Okay. Powerful explosives. Cool. And now you. Oh, I can also get the, the, the sky jelly. In that case, I'm gonna move over here. And you, my friend, play war. Delegations, love it. You know what, in fact, you can do that on the way home. No, you can't, okay. And once I have that city, I think that should be enough to become emperor. Nice, got torpedoes, uh, yes, computers. Alright, the, the jelly, or the sky squid. I think they can uh, stay back for now. I want all of you in the back. Let's go. Ah, you know what? Just you. You're gonna do ram over. It doesn't even matter. Ooh, more reputation. That's what I love. And now just invade here. Don't even have anything. Victory. Yes, your empire is now so popular and powerful that with a sufficiently lavish coronation, you could declare yourself emperor of all these lands and win. The coronation will take time and might repair. Choose a city to begin. Now you're just going to wipe up here. 
And then I'm going to take this little fleet here to my capital. And I'm going to defend the absolute mofo out of that. So build a building. I want a couple of birthers. I think one and uh, two should be enough. And I'm also going to design a building if I have any heavy flags or anything that I could use. Oh, chain rocket launcher. Mm. Oh, just Vulcan turrets. Nah, I think that's just a little bit too OP. Sabot cannon turret? Or cluster cannon. I think a cluster cannon would be cool. Yes. So one. And then I just need some ammo. Mm. Ammo store, one, two, three, like so. And then just one fire point. And actually these things need to be a little bit higher. Like so. Well, it's gonna be expensive, but I think it's gonna be well worth it. Mm. Actually, if I'm just gonna leave, move my entire fleet over there, then probably won't even need that. Oh, Pirate King is coming, okay. And you're going to, yes, you're moving to the capital. Uncontested victory, nice. Or like, see. Mad scientist. Oh sure, we can see the the uh, big Bertha in in action. Okay, not bad. Ah, whatever. Ooh. Withdraw. They have died valiantly. And now all of you also go back to the capital. That's gonna be a big defense. Delegations, yes please. Got some more research done. Flat cannons, that's what I want. Give me, give me all the, all the stuff. Brought life a hideous monster, but I can't really take care of them. As of right now. New age dawns. Okay, I shall now be crowned Emperor. Takes one year. Let's check our defenses. <laughs> okay. Okay, uh, yeah. And I also got two more in reserve, so... Just gonna repair the ones that need repairing. Odin. Yep. And friends, I think... I believe... This is gonna be GG. At least that's what I expect. Because, I mean... My friends all love me. So we are peace. I have... Three allies and the other two. Oh. 
They can't really do anything. What happens uh, just out of fun if I declare war here? Why not? Just wipe them out. So my allies are going to be at war with them now. And I guess just for fun I can just... Just for fun I can send the, the Odin over. Yeah, whatever. Uh, guided missiles I guess. You select all, take the Odin, invade. As much as possible. Foreign agents tried and failed to delay the coronation, okay. Nope. Anyone who doesn't want us to be emperor shall now speak up and be smited or remain forever silent. Stop. Oh, I didn't even notice you there. <laughs> yep, directed. Oh, they punched, punched a huge hole in there. Is that the good stuff? I'm gonna actually go in slow motion and see when it fires, which shall be soon. Yep, that's the Kalgerät. We've seen that in one action, but I actually want to see the, the Gustav fire. Oops, that one. Oh, there it is. That's the big projectile. And the Vulcan's absolutely shredding that thing. Here comes the Gustav. <laughs> Huge hit. And that crumbles. Oh, beautiful. Absolutely magnificent. Another nation gone from the face of the earth. Uh, well, that was a insanely fun campaign, I gotta say. And also something short and sweet. I enjoyed it a lot. Foreign agents, who, who even wants to... Uh... Oh, we got one more mad scientist. He's over here. I can't really defend against that, but... Whatever. I am shall now be henceforth be known as the dwarven emperor of mankind. And thou shall bask in my glory. Ladies and gentlemen, it's been an honor. Oh man, that was that was an amazing campaign. I love that a lot. I mean, if you look at money, oh <laughs> yeah, I, I have no idea what happened there. I think it was because um, they were not even close to the, to the just the sheer amount of wealth that I accumulated. Yeah, that was, that was a lot of fun. I think it had to do with the one research thing that uh, gave me like 40% more trade income. And I traded with like every single nation there was. Territory, yep. Claim the most territory. All always had the strongest fleet. Income, yep. Very high money. Tech I was always in front. Death, what's that? It's Madagascar. Him. Look at that. And then also a short replay of the territories. Yep. And then in the end, only one remained. And that was the Dwarven Emperor of Mankind. Thank you so incredibly much for joining me on this amazing adventure. And 
I hope she'll join me again for the next campaign because I am loving this game and I've got so many more ideas that I wanna that I wanna play. And yeah, see you again next time. Mr. Spear signing out. Live.